You mentioned that while well, we put security as a very important element in the R and D. All right. So how how Huawei defines security? What I would like to say yeah. is that actually we have a security framework across the Huawei, across the all products that we developed. Yeah. When it comes to delivering secure secure solutions and products to Canada, we've been working very closely with Canadian government, mm -hmm. and we actually trust and do whatever they ask us to do. So we have this open and transparent relationship. Uh, we give them all information they need to mm -hmm. perform cybersecurity risk assessment, okay. and then we fully comply uh, with their requirements, okay. which are compliant with the uh, Canadian standards and regulations. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so, so we actually uh, work with Canadian government. Yeah. We uh, get the guidelines okay. and requirements from, from Canadian government, yeah. and we deliver solutions and products up to their requirements. Okay. So when it comes to operating a yeah. network, we really don't have any access to the network. So once we sell network equipment to carriers, they have a keys to the network. So we are not operating, we don't have an access to any data going through networks. So that means you sell so to carriers have, yes. and there you have access to their user they, data, but not yeah, Huawei. We don't have an access. So you don't that. have a bad, we bad don't door? Have any, no, we don't have an access to their data. But in terms of like system maintenance, sometimes you need backdoor technology. How do you... We are, we, are fo yeah, we are following whatever guidance. Can, guidance from the government. Uh, they do have a processes for that. Okay. And they take security into consideration. Yeah. So whatever whatever the process put together, mm -hmm. carriers, and we are following them together. So that means uh, the data flows through Huawei equipment, but Huawei won't hold anything we of it. It's just no. go through the, yes. the end users we are, we are or some it. operators. So it's up to Canadian standards. Does the government like gui security guidelines up to the standard? You know, technology keep keep changing, yes. keep improving, right? And Sometimes they, today no problem, but tomorrow could be a problem. So they keep monitoring the, okay. uh, the, the network, they keep monitoring the threats, mm -hmm. they're coming back, up with the different threat models, yeah. and they're updating their security controls and their security framework okay. yeah. based on the most recent threats they see mm -hmm. uh, out there. So they they have a very strong team of cybersecurity experts in Ottawa. They're okay. one of the best in the world, and I think we should absolutely trust them. So um, when I'm speak, uh, talking about this, I talk about Huawei Canada in Canada, but Huawei operates in 170 countries yes. around okay. the globe, and actually we comply with local laws and regulations. So mm -hmm. in Canada, we go with what can Canadian government tell us. In so, other countries, we follow local uh, so laws and regulations. Do the, do the government require like uh, timely report, maybe quarter report from or any report from Huawei in, in terms of like security? They're, they're, I've talked to governments on a daily basis. <laughs> so we are actually we are talking we, every day. We, we are talking to them. My team talks to them on a, on a daily basis. I have a regular face-to-face -face meetings. So uh, we provide all the information in a timely fashion. Whenever they ask us for something, mm -hmm. we turn around and provide them to, to them right away. Okay, then I believe that Huawei and the Canadian government try to protect the data, protect the Absolutely. people all the time. Absolutely. But sometimes on the other side of the, it's just hackers, bad people. So are you like, I mean, defeating those bad people? For example, like, okay, you have a system that is so fully, fully secured, all right? But still some hackers, they want to get into the system, get the data, get credit card or whatever information. So I mean, in terms of technology, the Huawei has the the measures or security capability to defend those attacks. So we update our equipment in a timely fashion, and once we uh, sell equipment to Bell and Tells, it's up to there to do a security operations, to run security operations okay. center and run and monitor the security health of their network. I so see. they do that on a, on a, like seven twenty four. It's a very important job for them. So, so we have confidence yes. in Huawei yes. and the government. Yes. Okay.